If you're watching this video, I'm pretty sure that you've sent an emoji at some point during your life. That's because 92% of internet users have used them, with over 10 billion sent every single day. Now, Apple have just released their latest emoji pack featuring one of the laziest animals on planet Earth, the sloth. 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 I don't know. But whenever I hear about a sloth, I'm instantly transported back to one of my favourite countries that I've ever visited. Costa Rica. Bikinis in there in it hummus. The party's on, so they're heading downtown. Everybody's looking for a come up, and they want to know what you're about. Me in the middle with the one I love it, but we're just trying to figure everything out. We don't fit in well, cause we are just ourselves. I could use some help getting out of this conversation. Yeah, you look stunning there, so don't ask that question here. This is my own. I'm super lucky to have seen sloths on three separate occasions during my trips to Costa Rica. But on one particular occasion, I was not prepared for what would happen next. We were in the sloth park in La Fortuna. You pay $15, you go in, walk around, and try to spot a sloth. They're in the wild, but it's just a popular hangout spot for these creatures. We were pretty lucky and we saw two or three hanging out way high up in the trees and it was super cool to see. But it kind of leaves you wanting more. You want to see them up close. So we were heading out, pretty satisfied with what we'd seen, when we came across one sloth, quite a young sloth, hanging out just two meters above our heads. We watched it for a good 10 to 15 minutes and it was incredible to see. I mean, check out how this guy just moves through the branches. It's amazing. But we kind of weren't prepared for what would happen next. The sloth took one step too far, and literally snapped the branch and fell out of the tree. A once in a lifetime opportunity. And I literally took a selfie with the sloth. Sloths only move up to three meters in just one minute. And we check our phones up to 52 times every day. So if there's something we can learn from these super docile creatures, it would definitely be to take life a little slower.